What's up, nerdlings? What's up, nerdlings? Guess what? We finally get to join the club! Yay! We got a box! A big box! The nerd for art? Fragile. Must be Italian. Yeah, so uh, apparently we, and I mean, we already know this, but we live in some kind of geographical anomaly where we seem to be two extra weeks away from everyone we do, else. We yes. hit this place a geographical oddity. Two weeks from everywhere. The fantastic couple that is Scott and Jen of Retro Rivals. They have been sending out some artwork to people in the community, and we get to join some of the greats at long last. Everyone else has already got their artwork and put out videos. We just now got ours because... Missouri, apparently. <laughs> uh, so, I mean, first and foremost, what can we say about Scott and Jen? If you guys have not stumbled upon their channel already, well, shame, shame on you. Because they are an awesome couple. They love their video games. They love their tabletop. And boy, do they love their beer. Tom of Do You Nerd, Tom and Lacey, sent us a package. I cannot say thank you enough. Uh, we got to chat with them and to get to know gamers sometime back, and that was a lot of fun. Always love seeing the videos that they put together. They were on a little bit of a break to put these paintings together, but now they're back and gaming and drinking harder than ever. I think I might have made them sound like alcoholics. Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> All right, well... Let's get into this. Having seen so many of these other amazing, amazing art pieces and also watching the trouble that goes into trying to get them out of here. As we open this, uh, future Tom's going to do a little voiceover to give you guys a little bit of backstory as to why we're getting a piece of art from Rush of Rivals anyway. Right, a little bit of backstory. Well, it's probably best to start at the beginning. The year was 1997. Scott and I were a couple of outlaws smuggling some maple syrup across the Canadian-American border. Tell you what, if you knew how to find us, and if you had the money, we could hook you up with the best Canadian gold you've ever tasted. As fate would happen, one night as we're laying low in this pool hall, a little hideaway place we knew, it actually straddled the border. This rainstorm kicked up. And then this door was kicked down. There's Lady Lacey there. She bursts in, dual wielding Berettas loaded with fiery revenge. However, right there to meet her was Jen, back flipping over the bar that she worked at. And she's spinning these machetes in her hands like they're batons. And this is just another day of cheer practice. And, no, actually, you know what? It looks like they're just about done with that. Uh, I, I better wrap this up. So, you know what? Long story short, there was a PS1 game that they were looking for. I happened to have it, sent it their way, and I guess they decided to send us a picture. Simple as that. Intense drum roll. <laughs> That's a Christmas vacation. <laughs> Clock tower. As we saw with everybody else's, there's a note and a little signature Another on the back. Note. Would you like to read the, the back signature? Tom and Lacey, a.k.a. Do You Nerd. You guys inspire us every day. Thanks for being amazing. Retro Rivals. Aw, that's so signature. sweet. And then look at the, the cute little Do You Nerd box right there. Tom and Lacey. With a heart. <laughs> Tom and Lacey, Do You Nerd. What can I say? You guys are simply goals. If there were ever a couple to aspire to be in the gaming community, you two would be it. I need to tell you something freaky. Oh. Okay, not creepy doll on a front lawn creepy, but weird timing coincidence freaky. The day, no, the hour I finished your painting, you messaged us on Twitter asking why we were MIA and if everything was okay. I did the paintings secretly by design because it's always so great to get a surprise. Turns out you're psycho, or I mean psychic. I resemble that remark. Uh, he does. I like you, but you're crazy. Quick, what am I thinking right now? We can't oh. do that with the clothes on. Oh. 
That's right, I'm thinking I can't wait to meet you both in person. Try one of Lacey's famous shots and just finally get to hang out in the same room and share some laughs. Consider this a small token of our adoration and appreciation. Never stop supporting the community the way you do. You are the glue. Poet, didn't you know it? <laughs> Your friends always, Jen and Scott. Oh, Blank Man, you're such a poet. Do we do what everybody else did? Yeah, show yeah. The camera I'm, I'm going to show the camera first. Just FYI, <laughs> we don't get to see what's on the camera. That's bitten us in the butt a few times because we come back and it's like, oh, it didn't film anything. You guys get to see it first. All right, come on. How awesome is it? How long should we let them see it? Okay. All right, ready? Ladies first. Oh, <laughs> wow, I was right. Is, is it good? <laughs> yeah, it was it, it's is good. Is it really good? Yep. <laughs> oh, 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 that look is at awesome. That. Oh my gosh. Wow, again. Oh, just like so many other paintings that I've seen in the other videos. This does not look like a painting at all. It like doesn't. It's, it's with the, messing with the lighting and the sh shading and everything and the depth. Wow. It is so cool. Oh, look how expressive Link is, too. I know. I mean, he is going to chop <laughs> some freaking monsters. And the coloring, everything about it is it's, so yes. vibrant. Now, That's wait a minute. awesome. Wait, why would you do a Link painting? It's It's like you think we like... Zelda stuff or something. Oh my gosh, how many plushies do you have just right there? <laughs> One of the coolest things about all the paintings that Jen has done is she has been doing her homework for the people she sent the yes. painting out to and made sure to give them something that they love. And I mean, you hit the mark. Not like there's not a shrine back in the back or anything. She's fixing it on the shrine. Eh? This is so cool. I really freaking cool. love yeah. this. Wow, you guys. You guys are ridiculously Thank you so much. Kind. Yeah, so seriously, I mean, you you didn't have to do anything. That is I, awesome. I, I know in their video she was all about, well, you know, I, I got to pay back. It's like you didn't need to. Yeah. But I'm totally glad that you did because this is so cool. I mean, come on. It's a one of a kind yeah. Legend of Zelda art piece that's going up in our room. No one else's. Screw all the other people because <laughs> we get the coolest. <laughs> oh, that is man. amazing. This is so cool, guys. Seriously, thank you, thank you yes, so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Again, Scott and Jen are freaking amazing people. Really, really hope to get the chance to meet up with them someday, have some beers with them, some shots. World famous, after all. <laughs> I think I can oblige that. <laughs> <laughs> but guys, seriously, nerdlings. Check out Scott and Jen's channel, Retro Rivals. Links in the description below. Um, I guess I, I don't even know where to, I'm, I'm, I might be a little, <laughs> it's a little flustered. A little flaclimped. But uh, leave some comments down below. Hey, let us know if you've had any kind of interaction with Scott and Jen, whether it's been comments or if you've been lucky enough to get to meet them. Let us know your favorite Retro Rivals moment in any capacity. Let us know in the comments down below. I'm gonna go find something to hang this up with. So leave those comments, like, check out their channel, subscribe to us and them, to everyone. <laughs> check us all out on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram because we all got all that good stuff. And you know, go over to T Public because I'm sure everybody else is like us has merchandise over there. And if we like it, nerdlings, we nerd it. I especially nerd it for anything to do with Zelda stuff. Hi, 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 hi. You know, you can just take the rupee out of the jar. <gasps> Witchcraft. <laughs> Finer things. There you go, Tom and duct tape. How you doing, duct tape? Hi. You know we're going to have to hide that if Actually, Cap ever comes over, right? What do you think, Captain Algebra? <laughs> what do you think? It's pretty cool, right? Pretty cool. I guess I don't need this shirt anymore. <laughs>